Coming up on today's episode of Airborne Unlimited. Gamma 2022 aircraft shipment and billing report released. Piper Aircraft sees steady growth in 2022. Possible date set for SpaceX Starship launch. Welcome to Airborne Unlimited. I'm your host, Talon Lee. Let's get into today's stories. Gamma 2022 aircraft shipment and billing report released. During Gamma's annual State of the Industry press conference, the organization released its 2022 General Aviation Aircraft Shipment and Billing Report. Overall, in comparison to 2021, increases in shipments were noted across the entirety of aircraft segments. Cumulatively, 2022 preliminary deliveries were valued at $26.9 billion, a year-to-year increase of 6%. Of airplane shipments, 2022 saw 1,524 new piston engine airplanes delivered, an increase of 8.2% over 2021's totals. Turboprop deliveries in 2022 totaled 582 aircraft, a 10.4% increase over the previous year. Business jet deliveries increased by only two units from 2021's total of 710 aircraft to 2022's total of 712. The total value of 2022 airplane deliveries was $22.9 billion, an increase of approximately 5.8% over 2021. All told, 2022 saw OEMs deliver 2,818 fixed-wing aircraft for a total billing of $22.9 billion, a 5.8% increase of 2021. Piston helicopter deliveries in 2022 totaled 194 units, an increase of 7.2% over 2021. Turbine helicopter deliveries totaled 682 units in 2022, an increase of 7.6% over the previous year. In all, 2022 saw OEMs deliver 876 rotary wing aircraft for total billings of $4 billion, an increase of approximately 6.8% over 2021. And after the break, possibility of FedEx pilot strike looms. Unbridled passion, unequaled performance, unlimited possibilities. Hartzell Aviation, you are cleared for takeoff. Introducing Hartzell Aviation, leading general aviation companies united by the Hartzell guiding principle of built on honor. A commitment to uphold the highest standards in quality, performance, and support. Hartzell Propeller, Hartzell Engine Tech, Hartzell Aerospace Welding. We are Hartzell Aviation. Now boarding at HartzellAviation.com. Are you tired of tucking your phone under your headset to make a call and having cords and adapters strewn about the cockpit? Experience wireless cell phone communications and your personal music with Pilot Communications Blue Link 2. Blue Link 2 gives you a wearable link to two Bluetooth enabled devices at the same time and can even control your phone and music. Use Blue Link 2 with your existing headset or a Pilot Communications headset from pilot-usa.com. Throughout the globe, Piper Aircraft has hand-selected the very best in company representation, service, and support. From first inquiry to acquisition to product support, Piper Aircraft ownership is seamless and worry-free. Piper Aircraft authorized dealers, factory trained, factory connected. Welcome back. Now let's take a trip around the patch for some other interesting stories. Possibility of FedEx pilot strike looms. In the wake of stalled talks between FedEx pilots and management, Alpha's FedEx Express Master Executive Council unanimously approved a resolution heralding a possible strike authorization vote. Contract negotiations between FedEx pilots and company management have dragged on since May 2021. At present, no future talks are scheduled. FedEx MEC Chair Captain Chris Norman stated, quote, The decision to move closer to a strike authorization vote is the result of nearly six months of federally mediated negotiations that has led to our disappointment with FedEx management's actions at the bargaining table, end quote. Cost of downing mystery aerial objects unacceptable. U.S. taxpayers paid an inordinate sum of money to have three unidentified aerial objects blasted from American and Canadian skies. Between the dates of February 10th and 12th, 2023, aircraft of the U.S. Air Force, for purpose of bringing down three interloping aerial objects tracked over Alaska, northern Canada, and Lake Huron, respectively, fired a total of four AIM-9X Sidewinder missiles, each of which came with a $400,000 price tag. The destruction of the Lake Huron object required two missiles. Bell 505 makes historic test flight. 
Bell Textron's Bell 505 helicopter has completed a test flight fueled solely by 100% sustainable aviation fuel. The instance occasions the first ever flight of a single engine helicopter powered by 100% SAF. For a purpose of actualizing the milestone achievement, Bell collaborated with Saffron Helicopter Engines, Neste, GKN Aerospace, and Byrant Inc. Bell Commercial Business Executive Vice President Michael Thacker stated, quote, This flight is a monumental achievement for sustainability and decarbonization in the rotorcraft industry, end quote. Embraer's Phenom 300 leads light jet sales. Embraer, the Brazilian multinational manufacturer of commercial, military, executive, and agricultural aircraft, has claimed that its Phenom 300 series of business jets has maintained the distinction of being the world's best-selling light jet for the 11th consecutive year. As cited in the General Aviation Manufacturers Association 2022 General Aviation Aircraft Shipment and Billing Report, Embraer delivered 59 Phenom 300 series light jets in 2022, thereby bringing total deliveries since the type certification to an impressive 700 units. Well, that's it for today's trip around the patch. Let's get back to the rest of the news. Piper Aircraft sees steady growth in 2022. Piper Aircraft has delivered 15% more aircraft in 2022 than it had in 2021. Additionally, Piper's flagship aircraft, the M600 SLS, was even further improved with innovative updates. In 2023, Piper continues to see backlog for its M-Class lineup deep into 2024. Backlog for the plane maker's trainer aircraft extends beyond 2025. In 2022, Piper delivered a total of 69 M-Class aircraft, 19 M350s, 9 M500s, and 41 M600 SLSs, 43 of which were delivered domestically and 26 internationally. Of its trainer lineup, which includes the historic and well-loved Archer family, the wallet-friendly Pilot 100i, and the perennial multi-engine Seminole, Piper in 2022 delivered 167 total aircraft, of which 150 were delivered domestically and 17 internationally. Piper saw existing flight school customers such as ATP Flight School, Spartan College, and American Flyers grow their fleets. The company also welcomed new customers, including Thrust Flight and Fly Gateway, to the Piper Flight School Alliance. Piper President and CEO John Calcagno stated, quote, Growth in our two primary aircraft markets is of paramount importance to Piper Aircraft. Despite the supply chain and labor challenges our industry faced this year, we were still able to deliver our aircraft as promised, create valuable enhancements across our product lineup, and pass these improvements to our Piper dealer partner network and retail customers, end quote. And after these messages, possible date set for SpaceX Starship launch. Skyleader Aircraft offers a lineup of the most powerful, durable, and efficient light sport aircraft in the industry. From trainers to roomy cockpits for long hauls, Skyleader has an aircraft for you. And the best part? They're in your budget. Skyleader's base prices are set low to give you room to customize your aircraft to your needs, desires, and wallet, allowing you to put your money where it matters to you most. Visit FlySkyleader.com today to learn about our aircraft, customization options, and chat with the team. Well, hello, fellow pilot. I'm John King. And I'm Martha King. You know, we've all had our flying lives disrupted lately. Well, King Schools is here to help you stay up to date with courses that you can access on your desktop, iPad, or iPhone. If you'd like a refresher or just want to expand your aviation horizons, we have a course for you. So head over to kingschools.com slant rusty today for details. Welcome back. Possible date set for SpaceX Starship launch. A recent test firing of a Starship vehicle was a near complete success in so much as it met engineers' requisite runtime duration and saw 31 of the Super Heavy Booster's 33 rocket engines ignite and throttle up nominally. The critical test was conducted one day after SpaceX President Gwen Shotwell announced the company would not only conduct the test firing, but also make an orbital flight attempt the following month. Speaking at Orlando's Space Mobility Conference, SpaceX Senior Advisor for National Security Space Solutions Gary Henry called the 09 test firing, quote, really the last box to check. The vehicle's in good shape. The pad's in good shape. Pretty much all of the prerequisites that come to supporting an orbital demonstration attempt here in the next month or so look good, end quote. Should Starship perform to SpaceX's expectations, the immense vehicle, upon reaching Earth orbit, will earn the distinction of being the most powerful rocket ever to do so. To the subject of a Starship launch date, Mr. Henry set forth, quote, The FAA has a role here, so there's a launch license that is required, and we hope to secure that license in the near future. And I think there is some Musk TV in our future here probably in the month of March, end quote. 
And that's our show for today. You can catch episodes of Airborne on YouTube, Roku, or Fire TV. Just search for Aero News or Airborne, and don't forget to follow us on social media. Thanks for watching.